1 plus 10, satisfying price leak. Hello guys, I hope you're all doing great. We are back. It'll be a while before the OnePlus 10 Pro makes its way to international markets and for the time being, the OnePlus 9 RT will fill the vacancy, followed by the OnePlus Nord 2 CE. OnePlus on the other hand, has an ace under its sleeve in the form of the OnePlus 10R and according to Android Central sources, it will run MediaTek's greatest effort the Dimensity 9000. The report also reveals that the OnePlus 10 will not come with a MediaTek SoC, although it does not specify what it will run on. Although we haven't seen any Dimensity 9000 powered smartphones in the wild, its engineering sample has outperformed the Snapdragon 8 Gen 1 in benchmarks and real-world tests, so the retail version of the chip could do even better. As a result, the OnePlus 10R, which is expected to cost approximately $500 according to Android Central, has the potential to outperform the more expensive OnePlus 10 Pro running Qualcomm technology. The OnePlus 10R will get introduced somewhere in Q2 2022, according to the report and by then, the Redmi K50 and other Chinese branded smartphones which are said to include the Dimensity 9000 should have given us a good understanding of the processor's real-world performance. The 10R is slated to be released initially in India and China, with no word yet on a global release. Talking about the specs of the device, for the first seven years of its history, OnePlus only offered Snapdragon chipsets on its phones, but with the NOR 2, it transitioned to the MediaTek Dimensity 1200. That wasn't a unique instance because OnePlus had already committed to adopting the Dimensity 9000 in the OnePlus 10R by the time the NOR 2 was announced. The Dimensity 9000 is interesting because it has the potential to compete with the Snapdragon 8 Gen 1 on a level playing field. The Cortex-X2 is present alongside A710 and A510 cores on the chipset, as well as a Mali G710 shader core with 10 shader cores. To be told why OnePlus is using the Dimensity 9000 in the OnePlus 10R and not the OnePlus 10, it has to do with North America. The Dimensity 9000 has an integrated 5G modem with global 5G bands, but it is limited to sub-6 and lacks some wave connectivity. And with US networks relying on millimeter wave for 5G coverage and OnePlus intent on strengthening its ties with T-Mobile and Verizon, the lack of M-Wave connectivity has made the Dimensity 9000 a non-starter for OnePlus in the region. And that's why the chipset is debuting on the OnePlus 10R, which will be limited to Asian markets only. For the rest of the hardware, the OnePlus 10R will have a 120Hz AMOLED display and at least 8GB of RAM along with 128GB of storage. That's going to be all that I'm going to share with you guys for today. Let me know your thoughts in the comments section below. If you guys are new here, be sure to subscribe. The tech chat is over and I am out.